Hello everyone, welcome back. Today, my subscriber went up to 157. You might not think that's a lot, but every time that number increase makes me feel like, oh, today is a perfect day. <laughs> when you guys subscribe to my channel, it makes me feel like all the hard work about taking the videos, editing the videos, coming out with topics to talk about, letting you guys know what I know, hopefully it will help you. All these are motivations to me. I'm very thankful that the numbers are going up. <laughs> hopefully I can hit more, 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 more subscribers. <laughs> Thank you very much, this 157 people. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm just very happy that the subscribers are going up. So please subscribe to my channel. It will be such a great motivation. I'm, I'm really happy today. <laughs> I want to talk to you guys about Dior. Over the weekend, I went over to MBS. There was a pop-up store for Dior. Okay, there was a tiny hoo-ha over there when I was not allowed to take video, but I was told that I can take a lot of photos if I want. Then I said, it's okay lah. If I cannot take video, then <laughs> I don't need to be here. Then I think the person in charge came over and said that, okay, you can take video. We, we, we allow you to take video. I'm seriously considering one of their white color bags, which you'll see in the video later. When I was in Germany in 2019, I got this bag. This is the ultra matte black. The measurements is 24 cm by 20 cm and the depth is 11 cm. I just find that this bag is more suitable for people who are feminine, not someone like me, you know. I think it only went out for like 3-4 times. You see the protective sticker is <laughs> still on. <sighs> Together with the bag, I also bought this. This is the... I don't even know if you call this a card holder, a phone holder or wallet. Here, I have one slot. I see people put phones in here. But my phone's too fat to go in. And then... Uh, here are for the cards. Over here you have one giant compartment just to I think put cash or some excess cards bar. The charm is removable just like this. This one to me I really I actually really like this one. Just that I don't think I took it out often. Eh? This is lambskin. Lambskin give me the <laughs> Very easily color transfer, very easily scratch, very easily a lot of things. But if this one goes out, it goes out with this bag together. So, you know, when you take it out, it looks like it's matching. So cute together. See, they have their own charms. Mini and medium. <laughs> the bag also comes with this adjustable strap. Here you can see this. I kind of like the idea that it does this. We bought this bag at 3,700 euros, which is currently 5,500 Sing dollars. And when we were at the pop-up store, I was seriously shocked. Eh? The Lady Dior Medium at this point is at 8,300 Sing dollars. So in 2019, the price I can still accept for Lady Dior at 5,000 over Sing dollars. But now at 8,000 over Sing dollars, I really don't think so. But my opinion for classic bags, uh, if you really like them, buy them. Because the price will never drop. It's something that you can buy to invest, you can buy to use. Suddenly I'm interested in accessories. So I went to buy this from Dior. I think there you go. Yeah, it's a little gold hardware with the pearls. This one is quite cute. Oh, uh, for this kind of stud earrings, they will come with this kind of holder. And the pouch is something like this. It's one layer. And then this is like, it is see-through. So you can see what's in the back. This one, the price in Singapore is $620. By the way, just letting you know, in Chanel, when you want to try their earrings, they will give you this plastic stick and then you can just do this. You cannot put on to your own ears. You can just use the stick or example like a pen, right? They put the earrings through here. Then after that, you just do this to see whether it matches you. That's it. 
But in Dior, they will sanitize and then you can try. So this one is... They let me try, so I have to buy high. <laughs> because I have three ear holes, I need to... <laughs> spice things up a little bit with my accessories. So I also bought this one. This pair. We have a small little CD down here. I don't think the camera is capturing it. These are the pearls one long. Then I just thought like, okay lah, quite cute. Go ahead. <laughs> For this type, right, the pouch comes differently. It comes with a separator in the middle so that your earrings don't scratch each other. Which I think quite nice on this one. Uh, the Buy and Buy only does the same thing. This one, the price is at $680. Still reasonable, I think. And the last item that I have from Dior, also earrings. Just this one. It's a little pearl in front. Dangle like this. Actually, this one was the one that caught my attention first. I really like this one. I like dangle earrings. This one, the price is a little bit too much for me. It was at $820, Sing dollars. This one also comes in this kind of double layer. These are the only things that I have from Dior. Let me now show you the video that I took at the pop-up store. That's all for today's video. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye!